Hey, welcome back to Bed Squid. On this channel, we do math tutorials as well as simplifying education technologies using the iPad. Now, in today's session, I'm gonna show you how you can copy and paste like a pro. I'm gonna demonstrate this by doing a day-to-day -day tasks that I usually do uh, using copy and paste, but this is on another level. This is copy and paste on steroids. So the app in question is Yoink. Yoink. As in grab or snatch. Yoink. Okay, or just copy and paste. Yoink. Yoink. So most communication at work is done via email. And so I'm gonna show you an example where I'm gonna copy and paste text, documents and other files into the browser using Yoink. What Yoink provides is a central location where I can uh, use as a repository to place all of my files and then copy from there into my email. Let's have a look at this then. I'm gonna show you a live demonstration. So for example, if I go to uh, my Word doc here, there was this uh, formula sheet that I wanted to share with a colleague, but I just wanna make sure that this here, the volume of the formula, okay, I'm just gonna copy this copy and paste, okay, I've copy and pasted it. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come down to my doc here and I'm gonna use Yoink as a floating widget. I will go to this icon here and I'm gonna paste that text that I just took into Yoink. Now, so that's there, that's in the clipboard, okay? That's text in the clipboard. I can do other things as well. For example, I can hold down and copy this. So if I copy that, and then come along here and paste it. That's a PNG now pasted in the clipboard of Yoink. Actually, it might be useful for me to share this file with my colleague via email. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the, to the file browser here, I'll go to files, and I'm gonna find on my iPad in Word where that document is. And it's this one here, it's math formula sheet. What I can do with this is I can copy it straight into Yoink's file directory. So I'm gonna copy this, and I'm gonna drag it into Yoink's file directory. Now, if I go to Yoink, you can see on this iPad, now I've copied the sheet. So if you missed that, just in case, Yoink is a file directory. You can copy and paste multiple files. For example, look, if I go to Pixelator, I can copy some of these photos, okay, these uh, PNGs or these JPEGs into Yoink's file directory. So I'm just gonna copy multiple here. I'm gonna hold some of these down, okay? And I'm gonna put them straight into Yoink. Now, if I go into my Yoink, on this iPad, you can see there's this added files into Yoink. I've just copy and pasted them, okay? Straight from the Files app. Yoink! Let's say that I wanna copy some more text, this time from my Notes application. So I'm just gonna go here and look for Notes and click over here. Here we go, here's the text that I wanna copy. So I'm gonna highlight this and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna slide over my Yoink application and then I'm just gonna drag and drop this into the Yoink browser here. Okay, so that's copied the text. For now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my browser and I'm gonna write a new message and I wanna copy and paste the text to my colleagues. I'm gonna send this to bid. Please review and complete. First thing first, remember from the doc, I had Yoink as a slide over app, okay? So here we go, here's my stuff that I've copied in Yoink. I'm gonna copy and just drag this text into my email client here and that's gonna put in the text that I have. Okay, what about the other files that I have? What about the PNG? What about the formula? Again, if I go to my Yoink application here, I can just copy this and drag it into the email. I can even drag the text for the formula into the email. Um, what else? I can actually even grab the doc and it's gonna add it as a file. So if I look down here, it's adding the doc into the email client. Now that I've added all the files and text that I want in the email, I'm just gonna send this off to bed and that's gonna go. You can even download content from the internet using a URL. Now, if I go to Yoink here and I go to the add button, I could download a URL. I've already got a URL in the clipboard. So here I'm gonna press on download and you can see that it starts downloading this URL uh, and it gives you the percentage as well. Now I can click on this and you can hear that it's playing back. It's downloaded the song from the audio library. So let's just pause this and go back. And that's just scratching the surface with Yoink. In fact, you can copy and paste multiple file types and it has such deep system integration that you can copy and paste and synchronize your files across your different Mac devices. So if I copy and paste something from, the, from my MacBook, I can actually synchronize the files with the Yoink app on my iPhone and my iPad. It's that, that impressive. This application helps transform the iPad into a desktop or a laptop alternative. Unfortunately, it's a few dollars to download. The link's in the description below. It's not an affiliate link. I don't make nothing of it. If you found it useful, maybe give it a go. Please consider subscribing and turn on notifications. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.